The Oluwafori was accompanied to the State House by some prominent traditional title holders from Ishekri Lan. The monarch formally thanked President Muhammad Buhari for sending a high power delegation to his coronation, as well as his kind felicitation, goodwill, and solidarity. He described the president as a dogged patriot and fervent believer in Project Nigeria. As a Nigerian and the leader of the Ishekri people, it is with a great sense of responsibility that we pledge our loyalty to one united Nigeria as we support your government's aspirations to provide security and economic prosperity to all Nigerians, irrespective of tribe, creed, or religion. Like every other nation on earth, Nigeria has her problems to grapple with. But our firm belief is that as a united Nigeria, we shall stand well and make Nigeria a better country than we met. In unity, equity, and justice, we shall bequeath a better Nigeria to our children. I thank you, Your Majesty, uh, for this visit, and very impressed by your patriotism. And I assure you that uh, I will maintain contact. During the visit, the Ishekri leaders drew their attention to what they called some burning issues dear to their hearts. The issues include the underutilization of the four ports in Wari, Koko, Sapele, and Burutu, all in Delta State, reconstitution of the NDDC board, immortalizing the first finance minister of the country, Chief Festus Okoti Ebo, and resuscitation of the Ogidigweng EPZ project, which has been reportedly abandoned. I have taken note of, your, of the points you have raised in your address, and uh, I assure you I will work on them as soon as possible. From the State House, Adamu Sambo, NTA News.